An antinuptial contract is an agreement between a couple that dictates who gets what if the marriage ends in divorce. What if there are two separate agreements, which is valid? Hi, I'm Simon de Pinar and I'm a family attorney. A case recently came before the Supreme Court of Appeal concerning a married couple who had signed two separate agreements before they married. They eventually divorced. The court had to decide whether the two agreements were in conflict or could be enforced. One was a conventional antinuptial contract, also called a prenup. The prenup set out the terms of the couple's marriage out of community of property without accrual. The other agreement stated that the husband would provide additional support in the event of divorce, which included monthly maintenance for life payment of specified additional costs and gifting of certain assets. The court ruled that the agreements covered different territory and were both enforceable. The latter is a set of obligations, whereas the purpose of a prenup is not to create obligations, but simply to stipulate the matrimonial property system in place. The payment of maintenance by the husband to the wife and the gift of the assets did not alter the fact that the two estates remained separate. The agreements were not mutually exclusive. However, the distinction may not always be this clear. It is entirely possible that other separate agreements for marriage would not be enforceable. You should always engage an attorney experienced in family law when drawing up a prenup or other agreement prior to marriage. If you'd like to know more about the different matrimonial property regimes or prenups, please give me a call on the number in the signature below.